Well, my sleeping spot worked out great. It was warm, not too bright, not too noisy. And uh, got to wake up with the Burger King drive through lady taking people's orders. So, anyways, I'm gonna start up the car and drive down towards downtown Moab for the day. We're gonna go check the post office. Maybe some money's there. And, ooh. Battery sounds kinda dead. Battery's definitely dead. Hmm. It's a bummer. I guess I didn't charge it enough yesterday after it died. Now it died overnight again. And maybe I won't be going downtown for a minute because I'm going to be trying to find someone to jump the Jeep. Sucks. Something else going on, maybe? It's not going anywhere, huh? Maybe it's just the battery's gone, huh? Alright. Alright, well, thank you. That's alright. There you go. Well, the jump didn't work. The car's not even getting a spark now. I'm wondering if maybe that battery's just dead and done. It's not even a year old. But uh, I've killed it a few times. So, I don't know. Guess I'm gonna go down to the mechanics. And see about a battery. Could be a day of working on the Jeep. Well, I decided maybe a little McDonald's breakfast would be a good idea before I started working on the Jeep. Figuring out why it won't start. Ugh. Hopefully it's just a battery. Gonna try CarQuest. Hopefully they got good battery policy and I can bring it back. It was not a battery issue. I'm still stuck. Waiting on a call. I went down to CarQuest. They said I should call the towing company first and make sure I don't buy a battery that's going to go bad again. So they got to check the alternator. Anyways, the car's getting towed to a mechanic. So that's where I'm at now. Good thing I got some breakfast in me because it's going to be a little process. I get to ride in my Jeep on the back of a flatbed because I can't climb in the tow truck. So, they're going to hook it up right now. And me and Nora get to stay right here in the driver's seat. Pretty cool. A little adventure today, huh? It's not coming? No, because it's too close to the curb. And I, that's as close as I can get to the curb. Okay. So I'm gonna have to um, just Keep pull forward and, and then take me with you and extend it. Okay. Like so. this old Jeep always gives the tow trucks a hassle. I'm, it's the second time getting towed in this car, and the last time the guy that do all kinds of tricks to get it to go. Stubborn old car, I like it. Sounds good. What do you think, Nora? Huh? Okay, go ahead and put it in park. Okay. Great. All right.
This is fun. Huh. I feel like I should steer. Like I need to help her make this left hand corner. Kinda weird, huh, Nora? <laughs> Oh, buddy. This will give you a good idea of where we're at. Height wise. Shoot, I'm higher than the big rigs right now. Arriving at the mechanics. No steering. Arriving at the mechanics in style. He says they're a week out on repairs. Well, I just done it. Uh, I was just on a car quest talking to your guy down there. He called up here. Uh, yeah, well, we're. I had to have been talking to. Talk, talk to KL. The old guy down at car quest. Oh, an old guy? Yeah. <laughs> we'll be about here until next week. Shit. I can take you down to Arches. Okay. I mean... Yeah, if you guys don't have it. I need air in your tires. Oh, no you don't. Oh, I got it. That's down. your fault. <laughs> I got him on there good. <laughs> A good shot of Moab, the valley down below. It's like being at the carnival on a ferris wheel ride, getting ready to take off. It's a little bit more expensive than your uh, carnival rides though. I'm assuming... Rough, huh, Noel? Back on solid ground. So that battery's not gonna take a charge right now. I'm missing this one. I don't think so. Yeah, so let's, let's start with the battery then, right? Yeah. Because that one's done? Yeah, that one's cooked. Okay. Well, car's working again. It was the battery, just like I thought when I instinctively went down to CarQuest to buy a battery, and then CarQuest talked me out of buying a battery and going to a mechanic to get it checked out. So, luckily I went to a good mechanic, the tow truck lady recommended, and uh, they checked the battery first and replaced the battery. So I only had to pay $18 in uh, mechanic fees. Could have done the battery myself, so saved myself $18, but whatever. Gotta listen to your instincts, right? Don't let people tuck you out of what you think. Ouch. The trip's gonna take a change. It's gonna go in a different direction. Ambitions are staying true, but I'm getting back on course. Um, I'll see if I can explain the situation and what has caused me to come to this decision, but um, yeah, I'm feeling pretty good about it. I'm being a lot more honest and more true with myself, and I'll be able to do that with you, the viewers, as well.